everybody, it's Mama J. Inspector. We are here with four mystery boxes. Big boxes. Yes, very big boxes. This is $220 worth of mystery boxes from 83 Pop Talk. Okay. So, I got two. You got two. So, we're going to do this mystery box style. And at the very end, we're going to calculate the value and see who got the better deal. Okay. All right. Let's get the boxes cut open. Okay, so we've cut them open, put them to the side of us, and we're going to draw them out mystery box style. Okay. All right, why don't you go ahead and go first. And no peeking. All right. Bubble wrap. Blue bubble wrap. All right, bubble wrap. I don't know if the color means anything. But... All right, I got my first one here. I got Captain Marvel, 80 Years of Marvel. It's kind of cool. Yeah, this one's really cool, actually. Has the uh, first appearance of Captain Marvel. Marvel. Yeah, it's Marvel Marvel. Depending on how you want to say the name. All right, let's see what I got. I have clear bubble wrap. Did yours have a protector? No. And I got, oh, what's this? I got Mary Poppins. <laughs> oh yeah, Mary Poppins, that's kind of cool. Yeah, Mary Poppins. All right. All right. I got a business card. This one. Oh. And I have the glow in the dark, Vegeta powering up. I think that's a good pop, right? Yeah. But you have it. I think I might have the regular one. Oh. Oh. Okay. My God. Wooden Captain America? Yeah, you got one of the wood ones. That's kind of crazy looking. And those are cool because each pop is different. Really? Yeah. That's kind of crazy. Depending on the wood grain and how it came out. Kind of cool. You said you had a pop protector? Um, I don't know if I, I did, did or didn't. Yeah. yeah. But this is not the one that's in the pop protector. I got Forky. Oh, yeah, I do have one. Forky? Oh, which one is that? Just Forky. Oh, okay. Nothing right. special. I do have one in a, a pop protector and one not. Okay. This one is not. This is... Oh, this is Pikachu. That's cool. I don't... I think this is just the common Pikachu. Yeah. I think that's the one I might have. Yeah, it's just the common. Alright, now for the one that's in the pop protector for me. Okay. I have the Mountain from oh, Game wow. of Thrones. I don't know. That's pretty cool. So that's your pop protector one. Okay, and I got. Oh, I got the the what is this one? The winter con. Yeah. Winter con. So that one's cool. We got this not too long ago, remember? And it it's worth some money. I think we got the shared though. No, I think this was the one we got. We'll have to look at the value. So, those are out of the first two boxes. Yep. Oh, so now, oh, is there something else sticker. in there? Oh, I'm sure I probably do too if I dig around. Do I have to dig around for it? No, you don't have okay, to. Okay, good. Just so, remember it's in there. Oh, I will. I always clean out the boxes before I ship them to someone else. I right. have green bubble wrap this time. Didn't you have green bubble wrap last time? I have blue. I better get a color. Here's my sticker and business card. Right on top. Alright, I got one protector and three non. 
Okay. And I got the oh. Spring Convention Void, which is a lot cooler than the other Void. Yeah. Wow, oh, that's really cool. All right. I got clear bubble wrap again. <laughs> Alright, and then let's see. This one is not in a protector. And I got... Oh, I got Gamer Batman. Huh. That's I think cool. we have this still. Um, but he has a little bit of value. I don't know how much, but a little bit. That's cool. I haven't seen one of those in forever. Yeah, because ours has been stuck in a thing forever. Oh. Oh, it's Jack. Got Vampire Jack. This is like our fifth one. Yeah. <laughs> we got so many Vampire Jacks. <laughs> All right. Okay, that one I think is the protector. So and I got, oh, Glow in the Dark Game of Thrones Night King. I think we've had this before too. I think he has some value. Yeah, I know the HBO stickered one has a lot of value. Yeah. I don't know how much value, but I know we've had him before. I'm going to move these back and drop these down so you can see when I pull my next one. And I got Arthur Curry from Aquaman. And he's like, um, it says as Gladiator, but he looks in Prismastine Stone. That's pretty cool. I'm going to keep stacking. Um, I, I don't know. I don't want to do that. Alright, my turn. And I got... Oh. This is a different Kid Flash. Yes. This is Kid Flash 714. So this isn't the one that everyone's been overwhelming with. So this one's kind of cool. Alright, now for my protector pop. Okay. Oh my god. Got the Naruto Six Path Sage Mode. You don't have no, that in the dark, one? I don't. I have the full yellow one. But now I have the full colored one. This is a keeper. 100%. Alright, let's see what's in my protector. I think I, I won because yeah, I got that's... two pops. I got Ayara Stark from Game of Thrones. Huh. I, I don't know what the value of this would be. It does have a limited edition spring, spring convention sticker. So, I mean, if you're a Game of Thrones collector. So... So what do you think? What do you think got the better value? Oh, I don't care. I got two pops and I'm keeping <laughs> Well, you know what? We're going to go check value and we'll be right back. Okay, so we check some value? Yes. And we have a little list. So we'll show you what each one is valued at. Go ahead. So Aquaman, there we go, is worth $5.00. And then I got Gamer Batman. He is worth $12. I have Vampire Jack worth $9. I have Mary Poppins, which is actually kind of a cool pop. But she's only worth seven bucks. Wow. Yeah. We have the Void Pop. The shared one is worth fifteen dollars. Then I have Glow in the Dark Night King. I believe that's the overseas sticker it is, right? Yeah. There's a lot of glare on this. Unfortunately, we are using a different system right now. So, um, $19, though. Not too bad. 
And then I have Captain Marvel. It's worth 15. Captain America. Then I have Captain America, the wood one. And he is worth 12. These are kind of cool. Uh, what did you say? Each one is a little different? Yeah, each one is different. With the uh, like wood grain actually, and stuff. I mean, that would be kind of cool. This one looks, you can't really see a lot of the grain. But it's kind of a cool pop. So it was 12 bucks. Next I have Forky. And he's worth $14. Really? Yep. Wow, Forky is worth more than I thought he would be. Um, I got Kid Flash, but this is Kid Flash number 714. And Specter, you want to tell everybody what the difference between the two are? Well, they're different people. Okay, I just thought maybe you had some words of wisdom. No, I never liked that Flash. I don't even remember like his actual name. Oh, okay. I think it started so, with a J or something. Could be wrong. So this one is $8. And then I have... The Mountain from Game of Thrones, and he's worth seventeen dollars. Then I got Pikachu, and Pikachu is worth ten dollars. And then I have the glow in the dark powering up Vegeta, which is worth twenty-six dollars. Alright, and then I got Aurora, Aura Stark. Not a clue. Um, yeah, I neither one of us watched Game of Thrones. But I didn't because I heard it was really bad. Um, but this pop. Which is, what sticker is this? That's the shared MO City Comic Con yeah, sticker. Yeah, the Spring Convention. This pop is $31. And it's in great condition. It's just not one we collect. Nope. And then my final pop, which is my most expensive pop, is the Naruto Six Path pop. And he's worth $49. And he's a keeper. Yes. Right? Yes. Yeah. So, and then my most, well, this actually wasn't even my most, the one I just showed was my most expensive. This was number two, actually. And this is Miguel with the winner one. WonderCon. WonderCon, yeah. I don't know why I keep wanting to call it WonderCon. And this one was 25 So... But we just got this one in something else. I just don't remember what it was. So, so that was it. So what's your total? Well, my grand total, now these were $220. That's 110 each with shipping. My total for these was 124 Okay. So I was 14 up. Mine was 140 Wow. So I was $30 up. That's pretty good. That's I mean that that's pretty good. Yeah, that's really good. So, you know, it's not like we went way above it, but we didn't lose any money. No. Even on the ones we're not keeping. Yeah. So, you know, if you did see something you like, you can ask us. I'll let you know if we're keeping it or not. If we're not, it usually goes into mystery boxes, giveaways. I'll sell them if somebody reaches out to me. Um, you know. We do do our monthly uh, yard sale game where we will put all the pops up that we're not keeping and they will be 10% off to start. But then we have a wheel and you're already going to buy it at 10% off plus shipping. 
We spin the wheel. You could get 25% off, 50% off. Um, you could get the pop for free with shipping only. Uh, there's all kinds of things that you could do. And it's no extra to do it. You were already going to buy the pop. You know? Yeah. So um, a, lot of, a lot of people got some really good pops last time for free. Yeah. I think our highest free pop last time was like $42. All they did was pay $6 in shipping. Yep. It was just shipping. That's all it was. So. All right. So obviously, though, we did good. And, um, you know, we did. I think we only have one keeper, though. Maybe two. Yeah. All right, guys. So, hope you enjoyed the video. Um, so, keep your eyes out. Next time, 83 Pop Talk has a mystery box. And we will make sure they are linked down below. Bye. Bye, guys.